Oh, Minecraft for Kids 1, 2, 3, 5 here with another Redstone tutorial from Redstone Army. Um, today I'm going to be showing you guys um, my piston. Uh, well, my piston. Um, I guess you could call it. Um, you know, you know, I don't really have a name for it. I'm just going to say it's the piston. Yeah, screw it. Screw it. I'll come up with a name later. But, um, so pretty much all you do is step on the pressure plate, and wait. it comes up like this, and if you get it right here, you can see when you get stuck at all or anything like that, just step right up, and then you're on your platform. Now you can actually, you can build them, stack them, and stack them up, but it takes a lot of time just to do one floor, so... This is all the redstone for it. I'm going to be showing you guys how to do that in a second. Um, there's actually some underground redstone required too. This is the underground redstone. It's got two layers of these. You'll see why I have those in a second. Um, so you just step right up. Wait for a second. You know, you can actually set the timer so it's instant. Right here. So. I suggest you doing it with a um, 4x4. I wouldn't be doing anything complicated, you know, over complicated. I'm starting to do a little harder things, a uh, little harder redstone contraptions like this one. My elevator was actually hard, but uh, I thought it was easy because I had already figured it out and it was pretty easy to do. So you're going to need a ton of redstone, a ton of repeaters. A redstone torch, a ton of blocks. I suggest stone, and if you're in, um, and I suggest you also have a redstone ready thing. And um, oh yeah, pistons. And um, yeah, that's about it. So um, what I started off was with a simple half block square which I thought was pretty cool. And you'd start off like this, then you'd power this one, power this one, and then this one would get powered. I would push it up. So you're gonna do that for both layers. And you can actually make this so it's one side or two sides, either one. Now what you're gonna need to do, is you're gonna need to place a block on, on top. Beside, uh, behind everything. And now, next, you're going to place two blocks for this one, okay? And place redstone right here. Place the repeaters right here. These all should be zero ticks for now. Next, you're going to put it right here. Put this one right here. And put a repeater. And what I did was I actually doubled the sides for that one. Don't actually try doing that. That was a lot of work. But, um, and I would put in that. Um, hopefully I'll be able to get a link soon. As soon as, you, as soon as you activate it, you'll already see that that happens. Then when you remove it, it should bring back everything but the block. And you'll see why I did that. Because um, this needs to be retracted first. So you're going to put these at set three ticks. So that's a, sl a slightly slower thing. Next. You should do that. And then when you destroy it, you should pull it back. And so there you go. You can have that. But how, how does this block your way? Well, it already blocks your way. So let's say you're in a corner of a room. And you happen to have a little switch right here. Well, then you would see this. You'd be like, hey, it's nothing. Really, you would be seeing this. But then, when you flip the switch, pull it, and it releases a secret hidden wall. Um, this was actually a easy one. So now, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this and you're gonna put it on the opposite end. 
And that was actually a much easier one than this one. This is the staircase one. This is the secret hidden door. But this is going to take you to, this takes, this is going to take me to a whole nother level. Because now, I'm going to destroy all this, which is a less complicated version. I'm going to show you guys, um, well, I'm going to do, I'm going to do it with the double sided, like I said before. Um, that one is, was a mess up. So don't think that I'm going to be showing you guys that one. So you're start, going to start out with, obviously, that piston, that piston. You know, you, you go through the steps. Next, you're going to go two over. Start on your piston thing again. And then place your locks. And then this. Um, you're actually going to do it the two by two. So two by two on these sides. Um, and then you're going to place repeaters on all of them. So that you're touching all of them. And then redstone also. It just links to everything. That way, you can link everything up. So, um, when you activate it, uh oh, it missed the spot. there. So that pretty much takes away the one block thing. And so there you would have your thing right here. Then how would you get over? Simple. Now start off by placing a little four I think and then just step right over. It shouldn't be that hard. If you can't jump up, then either your thing must be lacking, or um, you got, or they changed something so that you can't jump over repeaters. Like, like they count as another block. But um, oh yeah, and then you want to connect these. This is the hard. This is the well. I wouldn't say hard part, but I would say pretty. Pretty hard to do. You connect it like that. So just simply put some redstone there. It starts the torch. Next, oh gosh, I forgot my pressure plate. Now this is not a trap, by the way. This is another piston thing. You're gonna connect these two. It's like this, and to put. That way, and you step on it. So when you step on it, it opens up. It gives you barely any time, so you got to be quick. And if you're laggy, I wouldn't suggest building this machine. If you were even, if you were even a teensy bit laggy, that could set off. That could mess up the whole machine. You'd be like, "What's going on?" And you'd be like, "Oh shoot! Oh, oh, well, it's screwed. I'm screwed." You know, and I don't want you guys being like that, so I'm just gonna go ahead. I, I went ahead and gave you guys a warning about that about lag. What the heck? Well, yeah, there, there's pretty much your entrance, and then you would, you wouldn't usually actually even see the distance. You would just see this. This is all you would see. Hello? I'm not making a video anymore. I am doing a video. I'm doing a video right now. Okay. Well, anyway, so that's the end of the tutorial on how to make a piston. Oh my gosh, I got stuck. Uh, yeah. Oops. Ah! God, I don't want this thing anywhere. 
Well, anyway, yeah, that's the end. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please comment, rate, and subscribe for more <coughs> from me. And um, so from Redstone Army, once again, peace!